Well, we're just days away from a special election in the 18th Congressional District, and the candidates are making a last-minute push to get out the vote. Ralph Iannotti filed this report earlier tonight. Listen, you know, the eyes of the world are on the 18th Congressional District right now. And that's something that we ought to keep in mind. Joined by political heavyweights Governor Wolf, County Executive Rick Fitzgerald, and Pittsburgh Congressman Mike Doyle, the Democratic Get Out the Vote rally was held in the lobby of the United Steelworkers building. A poll just this week showed Democrat Connor Lamb leading his Republican challenger in the congressional race by a very slim three-vote margin. That news buoyed Democratic hopes because President Trump won the 18th district by about 20 points. Here we are a few days out from the election and look how far we have come. Lamb thanked his union supporters, calling them the heart and soul of his campaign. At the same time, he was reminding them that the race isn't over yet. We have a chance on Tuesday to show that we still own the ballot box, we can get our people out, we can work harder than anyone else, and there is no price that you can put on that. At Republican headquarters in Green Tree, State Representative Rick Saccone said he sensed a growing shift in the momentum despite recent polls. It's been amazing that the response has been overwhelmingly positive, the momentum is growing. Saccone ripped into his opponent, referring to him as Connor the Chameleon, describing him as a far-left liberal. Connor the Chameleon tries to ride the line, one foot on each side, one day he's pro-life, one day he's pro-choice, until we outed him. And now he's pro-choice because he knows his party won't stand for anybody that's pro-life. Ralph Iannotti, KDKA-TV News.